And on entertainment news, to commemorate the 64th Independent Day celebration, the Lagos State Government has distributed 1,000 free tickets to the public, allowing phone seekers to unwind and bond uh, with their families and also loved ones. According to Idris Aregui, the uh, special advisor to uh, the governor of Ajde Sonlu on tourism, act and culture, the government's goal was to ensure that the memories of these celebrations would linger. Aregui stated that tourism in Lagos State would continue to flourish and that uh, residents and visitors alike would continue to enjoy the state's recreational centers for relaxation. And today's not just about fun, it's also about, you know, engaging ourselves, you know, talking about our values, reminding ourselves of who we are and, uh, you know, the essence of life. And that's the, you know, that's the most important thing, you know, we, we identify that, you know, we set up, you know, some problems here and there, you know, as a country, but the most important thing is that we all need to come together and find a way out of it. And one of the problems that I think that we have, uh, you know, as a nation is the fact that we always just think that yes, has, everything has to be, you know, come from the government. But of course, we need to intensify our friendship, our cooperation with government and, you know, you look at, you know, the people to see how we can, you know, begin to understand that uh, together we can, you know, create a better Nigeria and all that, but well, most importantly, you know, a better Lagos as well. The special advice emphasized the importance of public-private partnerships to drive terrorism development. Fonseca spoke to newsmen on their experience. So when you look at Lagos every day, now Lagos is not a place whereby from January to December you have activities going around and all that. But most importantly, we are in the Ember months. So the conversation around is even about you know the Ember months. And we're also moving from a dead December to a December in Lagos. Then people begin to have a better understanding of what they can do, how they can do, how they can, you know, how they can go around in Lagos. And most importantly, again, we're also trying to say that no matter your budget, Lagos is one of the cities that no matter your budget, you can live your life as a king. You know, whether you are the elite, you're the middle class or the lower class, there's always a place whereby you can reconnect and make sure you get the best of whatever you want. I think we need to do a lot more advertisement. Okay, we need to let people know what is going on in Nigeria. It's going to boost our economy a lot. We need to take our eyes off other things that are, you know, happening and just focus more on tourism. I want to believe that other countries in the world, they have a lot of um, um, financial advance when it comes to tourism, much more than even their natural resources. So I think we have a lot to show in Nigeria, much more than the fuel and the agriculture that we have. We have to stop bad mouthing our country because the world is listening. Right now, the, the world is a global place. Anything you say in the internet, every other person is sharing it. So we first of all have to try and project the positive image of this country, you know, so that we can attract all these other foreigners, the, the, the investment that we need. is by this um, image that we create, really. So we have to first of all try and project the positive things that are happening in our country. This place is awesome. Like, from the pool before, I don't know how to swim, but when I got here, I learned how to swim, especially this water park. It's unexpected. You can you don't expect where the water is going to come out. Very cool place. I think it's a work of development for tourism in Nigeria and Lagos State. Yeah, so we have more tourist centers like this available for families and for people. I think it's a good thing. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.